Ghost Gym 3. Hi, everybody. Hey, I wanted to show you guys this because uh, I know some of you out there have had uh, the issue um, uh, with your weapons and a bullet getting stuck in the chamber or, or brass that gets stuck and uh, it doesn't want to come out. It expanded. So this tool I found years ago is called Rapid Rod. Uh, I got it from a website called Botach.com, B-O-T-A-C-H.com. You know, I'm not promoting them, and I love their site, but this was a life series. I helped my buddy's AR when a round got stuck in his barrel. Anyways, this thing is awesome. Um, it, this thing is probably, I think, like nine bucks or something. Even has a place where people want to carry in their belt. Don't know why, but a uh, simple thing to carry. Look at this thing. It's, a, it's like a pole, and it extends. This thing is probably about, uh, right here, the body. This is about five inches right here. And what this does is basically it extends. It's got a little cable, as you can see right here. It's got a little cable on all the arms right here. Arms, legs, whatever you want to call them. And the tip, you could actually insert something like, you know, for cleaning. Um, you know, all the, you'll see on my video on my, uh, my uh, <coughs> gun cleaning kit. So you could put any kind of tip in there or one for patches or, uh, or whatever. And what I did is I put the one for patches. I have a metal one and a plastic one. And what I did basically, I use that as a tip. So what you do basically is just this extends out, and you turn down here. Well, you pull it first. So we're going to extend it, make it straight. You want to help it there a little bit. And oops. Okay. So now it's ex extended. I'm going to show you. This is the body right here. So keep it straight. And you keep turning this. It'll be better if I do it like this. So the cable, as you can see, it's you pull it here, and then we pull it into the body here, and then you start turning it. Come on. There we go. So you turn it counterclockwise. As you can see, this was inside this body right here. And as you turn it counterclockwise and you pull at the same time, here's what you got, straight. So what this does basically, I mean, you could use it almost like uh, uh, for cleaning too. Like I said, you put the head of a patch or up here, uh, that device here to put a patch or, or anything else, a brush. But basically I use that. And what I did was use this right here. This is plastic tip right here. Uh, I don't know why, but. I used a mallet and I we inserted this into the barrel felt where the bullet was you know right inside the barrel in the AR and I used this part here tapped it tapped it tapped it and sure enough we got the bullet out and another friend of mine uh, the shell was <clears throat> I guess from the heat expanded it didn't extract from his uh, AR and um, same with another friend on a on a rifle and we stuck this, this will fit a 22, his is a 22 rifle. So on both of them, we stuck it in from the end of the barrel, inside, you know, we waited of course a while, but remember this is just a shell, not the bullet. And um, and then we tapped it with the mallet, and sure enough, it got the shell out with uh, damaging the weapon. So this is a very good tool. It, believe it or not, it's actually come in handy. I probably ended up using it maybe four times. And all of them were my friend's uh, rifles. Uh, not, none of mine. That's never happened to me, thank God. Uh, once years ago in another rifle I had. But um, from shells getting stuck in the, in the chamber. And then uh, the bullet, of course, in the barrel. And uh, like I said, if that happens, you guys, you know, wait 10 minutes. They say different times, but just wait. The bullet is stuck in there, but obviously it's not going to fire or anything. Uh, unlike some rounds that are still live. But always be careful. Point in safe direction. So we waited anyways, let it cool down, and like I said, uh, since the bullet was closer to the end of the barrel, I mean, it's still stuck in there, like in the middle of it. So this is what we used to get the bullet out um, of the barrel. Great tool, like I said, it's like nine bucks or something like that, and it's called the Rapid Rapid Rod. So now you see this thing. So now to get it back, all you do is turn clockwise now, and you'll see the the metal and the, the arms or the legs or whatever they are um, getting loose and as you turn it count, uh, clockwise do that and then you, you can see the cable right here and you just 
pull the little legs. Actually, you want to. There we go. They don't come out. Just pull them out yourself. They're not screwed in. Only the bottom part that. Uh, the base where you lock it and then this is all you do and you just pull a little of the cable because then you'll end up with this much and you fold it great device I'm telling you this thing has been a blessing my friends went out and bought it after they saw this because it saved their rifle and got the bullet out of the barrel or the shell out of the the rifle when it expanded and got stuck in there so inexpensive and uh, I, it's a must have um, had I known about this a long, long time ago, I would have got it. But, yeah, you could use different things. I mean, uh, some long little poles or something you have. But, like I said, this was awesome for that. I mean, hey, nine bucks, if this got destroyed, I'd just get another one. So, anyways, uh, that's the Rapid Rod. Hope you guys like this. Subscribe to my channel if you wish. I got some pretty good videos. I got more coming. And, uh, basically, click the like button, my friends. I appreciate it. Hope you like this rapid rod. Take care, guys, and God bless.